All right, now we've got a story about five little monkeys, but not jumping on the bed. We are reading in bed. Do you ever read in bed? I like to read in my bed. Look there, they're brushing their teeth and getting ready to read books in bed. When the first, the, when the five little monkeys are ready for bed, their mama reads stories, then kisses each head. It's bedtime for monkeys. Now turn off the light. Oh, mama, one, what? Oh, please, one more story tonight. But mama's too tired. She's read more than four. Lights out, sweet dreams. She closes their door. One monkey whispers, this book looks so good. If mama won't read it, then maybe we should. It's such a good ending. Their sobs turn to cheers. Those monkeys are loud. You should cover your ears. Look, his dad finds him. Hooray, hurrah. In fact, they're so noisy that Mama runs in. What's all this racket? What this chaos, this din? One monkey admits with a guilt-ridden look, we've been reading the very best happy sad book. Mama raises the out an eyebrow. What was it I said? Lights out, sweet dreams, no more reading in bed. Then one monkey sighs as she turns out the light. I wish we could have read the new ghost book tonight. Just look at that goblin and me looking ghosts, those shadowy bats that I like most. Ooh. One monkey starts hooting an eerie ghost sound and soon they're all wailing and jumping around. Then a dark, spooky shadow appears on the wall. But a knock on their door is what frightens them all. It's the ghost, they all scream. But then, Mama walks in. What's all this rackus, this chaos, this din? The monkeys all gasp. We thought you were the ghost. This book is so scary, we like it the most. Mama raises an eyebrow. What was it I said? Lights out, sweet dreams, no more reading in bed. One monkey shivers, that book was so creepy, so good, but so scary, I'll never be sleepy. She pulls out a joke, but we've got to be quiet, but the jokes are so funny, in fact, they're a riot. The monkeys try hard not to giggle or laugh, but then there's a joke with a foolish giraffe. <laughs> it says, why do giraffes have long necks? So they can wear lots of ties. <laughs> And they all laugh. It is so silly, so goofy. They all start to roar. And then can you guess who flings open the door? Oh, yes, it's Mama. She comes storming right in. What's all this racket, this chaos, this din? The monkeys keep giggling. They just cannot quit. Mama picks up their books. I've had it. That's it. Then she raises an eyebrow and says, Did you hear what I said? Lights out, sweet dreams, no more reading in bed. Well, the monkeys are tired, they're almost asleep when they hear someone giggle, then laugh, and then weep. Do you hear all that noise? And just who can it be? Let's sneak down the hall. Can you guess what they see? Let's see what happens. It's Mama! Oh, Mama, they giggle. What was it you said? Lights out, sweet dreams, no more reading in bed. Those monkeys are sleepy. They head out the door. Just wait till tomorrow and then we'll read more. And that's the end of our story.